it's very important for the whole thing to be well assembled. The fact that the joint here between the body and the neck, it's very well done, will have an effect on how the guitar sounds and how the guitar plays and how the guitar feels. We came up with the numbers that we thought were cool for guitars like 1954, 1950. We get the bridge plates that we believe are correct and then we stamp the numbers. We can also offer, you know, a chance to the buyer to decide if you want to have like your birthday or any day to mean something special for you. When a guitar is completed, what I do is I play it and use it for weeks or months just to get used to it and just to get the feel for the guitar. And if you play it, it's just like an old friend. got the, um, the ashtray, you know, it's got number seven on the bridge plate. With this guitar, we try to replicate the finish from 1951. The color to it is more of opaque kind of finish. It's not the see-through. It's got a lot more primer coat. There's a, um, a buckle where, you know, the size of Texas on the back. It's also a, a very light guitar. The back of the neck on this guitar is, feels very, very smooth and the lacquer on the on the top, it's kind of like peeling off, like flaking off, like some of you know all the guitars do. I think it sounds good, you know. So this would be like the bridge pickup, and you know, here would be both pickups together. you know, the neck pickup. Mm -hmm. 